Hey everybody, this is James Wallace with Transit. We're here today in Raleigh, North Carolina doing some of our educational programs. We started this morning at Holly Grove Middle and now we're waiting to start a show here at Banks Road Elementary. We wanted to go ahead and bring you guys the fourth installment of our vocal percussion video series, Rhythm in Motion. Two real quick things to get to before we start. As always, if you have comments or questions, just leave them with us and we'll definitely try to get to them as we go through the series. And the second thing I wanted to mention, you guys have probably noticed, I'm not using a lot of technical terminology as we're doing these videos and I'm gonna try to keep it simple, but as we get more complicated and complex, we may have to bring some more in, but uh, just bear with us and we'll definitely get through it. All right, so today we're gonna do two basic things. The first thing is we're gonna look at a short inward breath as a hi-hat sound. And then once we do that, we're gonna go ahead and do a very basic rock beat, uh, our first beat of the week. So let's go ahead and move right away to that inward short hi-hat breath sound. And basically what you're thinking about with this is a breath sound to mimic a hi-hat sound like the T or TH, hi-hat sounds we covered before. You wanna do a short inward breath to mimic that sound and basically to give you a chance to breathe during your beats. So what we're gonna think about with this inward hi-hat sound is we're gonna think about our top teeth touching our tongue, and then we're gonna think about a short, quick breath inward to produce that sound like a hi-hat. So it's gonna look and sound like this. Now, we always want our sounds to be compact and short, so that's one reason we want it to be a quick breath, but also, again, we wanna imitate and mimic that hi-hat sound from the T and the TH sounds, and the best way to do that is to make this a shorter sound. So again, think about the top teeth on the tongue, and as you do the quick breath inward, think about the top teeth coming off the tongue. Sounds and looks like this. All right, so let's go ahead and move right along to our beat of the week. We're gonna do a very simple rock beat. Now, to, th to think about this beat, I want everyone to think about the basic counting one and two and three and four and. Now, to do this beat, we're gonna go ahead and incorporate all the sounds we've done since the beginning of the series. We're gonna start with our B kick drum. We're also gonna go ahead and utilize our T hi-hat sound. We're also gonna use the basic K snare sound we did last time. And finally, we're gonna go ahead and put in that inward breath uh, hi-hat that we just looked at a second ago. All right, so we're gonna do the basic rock beat, uh, listen, and I'll go over it real quick after I'm done. All right, so as you guys could hear, Occasionally, for my hi-hat sound, I would use that little in-breath, inward breath sound that we just learned. And as you can also hear, when I got to the three and, instead of doing kick uh, hi-hat, I did kick kick. Just to vary it up a little bit, give it a beat that is a little closer to what you're, you would actually hear in a rock song. So I'll do the beat one more time at that speed and then we'll do it a little bit quicker. So here again is the beat. All right, now we can speed it up a little bit, the same beat, just a little faster. All right, so definitely you wanna work on that beat, start slow, work your way up to doing it faster. And then one last thing I wanna leave you guys with is a little way to make it more, more complicated, more interesting if that beat's coming to you really quickly. You can also think of ways to do fills. We'll just stick with some of the sounds we've already learned. So you can really use these sounds in any way that sounds interesting and fun to you. But I'll go ahead and try to just stick one in that, that comes to me as I'm doing it. So again, the basic rock beat with a little fill thrown in based on what we already have. All right guys, this is James Wallace with Transit for our fourth installment of the Rhythm and Motion video, percussion, video vocal percussion series. We'll be back at you guys next week with a brand new video. Thanks everybody.